Hey my divas, what's up? So I'm here to show you guys what is going to be in my um, weekly makeup basket. And this basket is going to go from, I know I'm a few days late, so this basket is going to go from Monday the 1st until Sunday the 14th, so Valentine's Day. Okay. Um, the first thing that's always going to be in my basket is this little palette here, which has um, the NARS blush that I always use, which is this one, and then this MAC eyeshadow in bamboo. Um, the next thing is my Anastasia brow powder in dark brown, and I have like hard pan, that's what that is. Also, my Milani um, Clear Brow Wax Pencil. And then, I'm using this on my lips before I do my makeup. The Maybelline Baby Lips in Quenched is just a clear lip balm. Um, I also have my MAC Fix Plus, which is way down here, just a little bit left. And... Let's start with the eyes. Um, I use this off and on. I'm trying to use up this side here. This is Milani Brow and Eye Highlighter, and this one is Vanilla. And so I'm trying to use that up, just this little side, and that's what it looks like. Just put it right underneath my brow. Um, for my eyeliner, it's still this tiny little Lord and Berry eyeliner working on that and I also threw in this Urban Decay eyeliner um, this one is in Uzi and Empire so it's just a purple and a gray you can see that this is a purple and a gray color so just for fun this pencil is so old like really old um, I have three mascaras so the first one is the Lancome Seals Booster XL. This is like a um, mascara primer. And I have been using it. I used it today. Um, I don't know if you guys can tell a difference in my lashes or not. But um, the two mascaras is the L'Oreal Voluminous Butterfly and the Lancome Hypnose Drama. Now I can see a difference when I use these two together, but when I use it with the L'Oreal, it's like, mm, you know, maybe if I put on another coat of mascara, um, it will come through. I guess that's a little bit better. Okay, so there you go. And for my eye base, it is the Color Tattoo and Cool Crush, which has like the purple shift to it. That's what that looks like. And that's what it looks like on my hand. So, um,. I have that underneath my eyeshadow today. I like it so so. Um, I wouldn't say it's like my favorite thing in the world, but it's a pretty color. Um, my bases for my face and my eyes: the Urban Decay Primer Potion and the L'Oreal Miracle Blur. This stuff has really been helpful to me um, since the winter because I have a lot of dry patches on my face. I'm not feeling that. And I am setting underneath my eyes with this little sample um, of, can you see it in there? It's just a little bit of Clinique, some kind of translucent powder that they gave me um, that I just, I've never used this, so I'm just going to use it up. So on to the face. Um, this here is my Maybelline Matte and Poreless Foundation. That's all that's left. 
So I'm trying to finish that. And my MAC Pro Long Wear Concealer. And it is literally right there at that line. And I have used it, but you know, it's taking some time. So there's that. And for my eyes, like my um, eyeshadow, I'm still using this palette here. So this color here is going underneath my brows and the next color is my inner corner highlight. And this week my palette pick is the Naked palette. Um, the colors that I'm focusing on is going to be this one, Naked, Buck, Toasted, Hustle, and that's it for that palette. So I put Toasted all over my lid and Hustle in my outer V, and then Buck and Naked are both in the crease. Highlighters are the same. Um, the Benefit Watts Up, which is here. And I am topping that with my MAC Trace Gold. This is like my favorite highlighter because it's so natural. Like you see how soft that is? It's not like all up in your face like these other highlighters are. And that's what I have on. That is the shine, baby. So um, I love that. This is actually a blush topper. It's a sheer tone shimmer blush, but I use this as like a blush topper too. Really, really pretty. My actual blush is from Clinique. I've had this so long. Like this is the first high-end piece of makeup I ever got and my mom bought it for me. So I've probably had this for like seven years, <laughs> no lie. Um, but this is Clinique Smoldering Plum and it's so pretty. So that's my blush. I don't know if you guys can see it on my face, but there's a swatch of it. And underneath Smoldering Plum, I have that NARS blush. I just put a little bit of that and then I layered this over the top. And last but not least is my bronzer. And this one is the CoverGirl Queen Brown Bronze, number Q110. So that's the bronzer I have on today. And it's a nice color for me in the winter because it's soft enough but not too like in your face. Um, for my lips this week, or this week and next week, I am going to use the Jordana Easy Liner in Silver Lilac. And I really have not used a lot of this at all. There is that. And my lipstick is MAC Sheen Supreme and Bare again. I had to put the Jordana down all over my lips and then put this on top because you can't even see the color. This lipstick is, it's very, very light and creamy. It's showing up on my hands, but my lips are pigmented, so it kind of just gets lost. But that's how much I've used of that. And I'm hoping that by the end of this two weeks, it'll be done because these go pretty quick. So that is everything, you guys. Um, I also have two glosses here in case I want to top. This one is pretty low. So I'm about halfway through this one. And this one here is about there. Like right about here. So I could do either one. Let's throw a little bit. There we go. So that is everything. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you in the next one. Deuces.